Lightning. That's poor play from Longford at the back. This is a chance for Dryna to have a run at the town defence. That's a brilliant tackle from Barker, but another chance here for Cove. This is Larkin. Larkin with the cross towards the back stick. He was looking for Connor Dryden. Longford could have been punished for some sloppy play at the back there. Tony. Crossed into the area. It evaded Dylan Barnett, but uh, luckily for him, his full back, Ben Lynch, was there to back him up. Bit of a skewed clearance. It will go out for a corner. He went back stick with the last one. Let's see what he does with this one. Plenty of bodies forward here for the team in yellow. Abbott sends it in towards the centre. And a goal free header as well. And it was Brendan Frahel, the captain, who rose highest. And he really should have scored, Tony. Move from start to finish. Just taking their time with this throw in. It's Elworthy to Malloy, who's had very little involvement so far. It's a decent ball as well. And... Uh, I think it might have taken a little nick on the way through, so Barron had to be alert to that. Against, let's see what Longford can do here, though. With Verden, he tries a ball inside to Craven. Craven all the way out to Eric Malloy. Malloy takes on his man. Malloy easily dispossessed, but Elworthy gets the rebound. He crosses it in. Really good goalkeeping from Barron because Graydon had crept in at the back post. He had gone up for the header, but he's beaten by the fist of Barron. Here's Graydon again. Great, nice bit of skill to get by Carbo. He's into the penalty area. Cross off the left. Could go anywhere. It's hit the crossbar. And it's Sam Verdon that clips the top of the woodwork. Yeah. Off for town, right full back. Barnett. Ball in towards Verdon. Verdon's going to let that one run through. And that's a good decision. Here's Craven with a curling shot. What a goal from Darren Craven. The man is. But she just invited uh, Benny and O'Brien Whitmarsh onto him there. But gets the ball away in time. And uh, Barnett going to try the same again. Here we go. Layoff from Verdon. Shot from Craven. This time he's uh, put that wide of the near post. But uh, almost an identical bit. Going to want to watch that one back again and again and again if you're a Longford Town fan. Verdon to Graydon. He's got support outside. He goes through the centre. Verdon, can he take it? Under a spell, he can. Shot is blocked. Here's Craven again. And that's just inches wide in the end. Kick long. Out towards the left-hand side. But Shane Elworthy... Brilliant in defence there. Here is Embuelo. He's had to put his boot through that one. And that could be a decent ball. That's a mistake from Barnett. Big chance for Cove. It's a massive save from Luke Dennison. His uh, there from Dean McMenemy to open up a bit of space. He tries to play a diagonal ball out to Graydon. Graydon appreciated the effort though. He gave the thumbs up to McMenemy. There's a foul from Robinson and that was that a little a bit cynical. Kick. That, that is a free kick. Could be in trouble here. Yeah, and the referee's going to go to the pocket and there could be no complaints there from him now with great discipline because uh, he has picked up a booking just before half time here's Drynan who's come out to this uh, opposite side of the pitch some nice footwork from Drynan he's going to have a shot on goal and he's got plenty of purchase on it as well but it does flash wide of Luke Dennison's far post Lynch to Graydon Longford have got plenty forward here Craven he was trying to flick that but it's run through to Eric Malloy Malloy lays it off to Verdon big chance and Verdon just lost Offside his balance flag, flag was up anyway but Eric Malloy perhaps could have been a little back there, tracking back and uh, blocking that one away for the corner to Cove Ramblers. Dale Holland and Jason Abbott, they're going to take a quick one. Here is Holland. Driving cross from him and Connor Drynan got the slightest of touches on that, but there was too much pace on the Sam Verdon, he's beaten to this one. He was looking for a free kick, but that looked like fair defended to me. Robinson, Ooh. he got to the pitch of the ball first, and then it was the uh, Ramblers player that ran into him. But the referee is actually... I think he's going to penalise Aaron Robinson here, is he? I don't think that. And uh, ball breaks the way of Sam Verdon, lays it off to McMenemy, gives it out wide to Graydon, who just has to backtrack to get on it. That slowed him down. And he's won a free kick, he's done well there. He didn't have a whole pile to work with, and uh, he's got Longford a free kick. He's turned there, gives it back to Dylan Barnett. Longford happy to keep the ball for now. But they'll go along this time up towards Sam Verdon, who's done really well to... Break that one down towards Craven, and Craven will get on it in the end. He's going to have another shot on goal. Not as good as earlier on, though. He's put this one. And Dylan Barnett into the centre of defence there, and Ben Lynch, who's played fullback before, is now in that fullback Ball in role. towards Swip Marsh, who hits it on the spin. That was a really difficult chance for him, though. And it's out harmlessly in the end for a goal kick. Integrity, who is a big presence up there for Cove. They've certainly got a target man to aim at now. Here's the target man for Longford, though, that's on the move. This is Joe Doyle. First touch takes him wide, and again, we can almost put on a, a replay from a few moments ago in Bueo with a crunch and tackle on Doyle, who was trying to... As Jose Mourinho once said, they can take home the ball, I'll take home the three points, and Longford Town will be happy to live by that 
rule of thumb here if it stays this way. But a shot on goal. But Dennison, he was waving that one goodbye as it uh, went past his near post. For Doyle, who's had plenty of involvement since coming off the bench on his debut here for Longford Town this evening. Carl Chambers tries to keep this one in play. He's done really well, Chambers. Look at that for a cheeky bit of play. And a shot oh, on the outside of the boot is saved by Barron. By Barron Chambers. is not happy at all with the assistant referee. Midfielder. We'll see what that means for the shape of the team in a second, but more importantly, a corner for Longford Town with just over five minutes remaining on the clock. Ball in towards the front post, lots of pace on it, and it's a header from Eric Malloy, and there is his famous celebration. We've seen that a few times down. They've shown some lovely individual performances this evening, Cove, and they've been a really hard nut to break down, and are they going to get rewarded with a goal? This is a big chance here. Luke Dennison with a save, and the rebound is going to fall to Hegarty, and that's blocked away. Dennison again. Oh, look, pass. I suppose you can do that when you're tuning up. Doyle to Barker, who sends it long. And Boyo, though, has given it away to Sam Verdon. Sam Verdon's in on goal. Heavy touch. Good save from Barron.